Okay, I'm going to show you a quick and easy method for making pallions of solder. This is a easy solder sheet. I've already taken the scratch brush and shined up both sides. You want to get any oxide layers off of there before you cut your pallions. Yeah, we'll begin by taking the snips and cutting strips anywhere from oh, a millimeter to a millimeter and a half wide. And just shave them all up to about the same point. And we'll go all the way across this uh, particular piece. And you can vary the width <clears throat> a little bit. Some you'll want a little wider than others. Okay, you can see they've all curled up here. <clears throat> That's typical of what happens with your snips. So, we'll take our pair of uh, duck bills here and just slide from the point where you stopped your cut and just pull them through under a little bit of pressure. Flip it over and go from the other side. And if you want, you can bend just a little bit as you go along, take some of that curl out and get them all trained back up. Uh, the ones on the ends always seem to want to train the least. So you Probably have to do those individually. Get them into a cone shape, like such. And we'll take our snips again. Place the value of the uh, cheat against your thumb. And just lay your shears in next to your thumb. And cut away. And all those little pallions just fall right off. And once you've got them all cut, I'll stop there for now. Just gather them all up, get them into your uh, little bench scoop here, and then dump them into your uh, solder bin. I use an old uh, pill bottle here, holder. Uh, I've got it marked here for silver uh, easy, medium, and hard, then yellow easy, medium, and hard, and then 14 karat white easy. Pretty handy to have, doesn't take up a lot of space on your bench. So that's a quick and dirty method for uh, creating pallions of solder. Uh, works works for all those different solders uh, that you get into sheet form. So, thank you.